Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to another episode of Craft the World. And this time, I want to focus a lot on the house, but I also like to focus a lot on the technology tree. Let's get ourselves a little further ahead before this happens. Also, let's talk about this. I'm trying to figure out how to time these episodes. Last one was a little over 50 minutes, and I can see where it's a little hard for, for some folks to find that much time to sit down and watch. You know, shorter episodes are easier to watch, but they feel like they end too soon. So what is what is that balance in between? I'm thinking we've got a one-hour cycle here. It goes for something, you know, I don't know if it started at 50 minutes or 48 or just what this exact timer lands on. But I'm thinking with the length of the battle, we're looking at about an hour. So if we take this down about 15 minutes, this episode... And then next time will be 15 minutes, and then a 10 to 15 minute battle, and then starts the next timer again. So 15 to 20 minutes left should be about the right timing on that. Because like right now when I'm talking, we're adding time to the video, but this isn't counting down. So there's going to be quite a few uh, pauses in that timer. Anyway, um, what am I looking at here? Basic weaponry. It'd be nice to get into archery and get a couple of them trained up into archery before they spend too much time training up uh, as melee. To do that, what do we need to do? We need to get advanced ironworking going, so we've got to get the forge going. So that's probably our first step. Once the forge is going, we can get much better axes and picks and an improved portal. Now that's something that's new to me. That wasn't in the game when I was playing. What does it do? It almost looks like the portal that the that it used to start with. So it can open portals to biomes and multiplayer games. Okay. So that's that is something new. So that's probably not something for this series. Okay. Anyway, the forge requires what? It requires water. Water requires a bucket. Mm, bucket. Mm, okay, where's the bucket? <laughs> um yeah, okay, let me stare at this a while. Bucket. Why it's in armor, or in you know, military. Um, you got me on that one. Used for collecting water. Okay, we'll go with that. Anyway, need a bucket. So let's get that going. And that's not what I meant to do. Back to here, there, and that. And we do have some planks. All right, so we'll do we'll do six of those, and let's get planks going. Actually, I already have that in there. We'll do all those. All right, we need to get wood. So really, wood is our next chore while this stuff is building. There we go. And wood. Low health? Uh-uh. Did you fall? All right, let's do that for you. Come on back home and get to sleep. Very good. Now, that's bugging me. So, let's put a portal like right there and take that out. Chicken, chicken, all the leather for when we get to the leather armor. Take that out too. Otherwise, let's just collect all the wood that is available to us. Low health again. Oh, you're taken care of. All right, where was I? Right over here. Let's take all of these out. And I'd like to take a few more of these out and just leave this guy here. Although if I do that, I'm sure the skeletons are eventually going to pound their way through. Anyway, over here we do have a sheep that's not ready yet, so we'll call this area done. Let's take this one out. Let's put another portal right there to handle that, 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 and that. And while we're at it, let's do those two roots. And that is... Done. Let's add another portal over here. And I think we can forget about that side now. It'll take care of itself. Over here, let's pop one in there. Give me these. Not the snail. Yeah, we'll do the snail too. I don't know if we'll get to use that chitin, if that truly was where it came from or not. But uh, it's, it's easy enough to, to get. Root. And can I fill this in yet? There's no fish in there. Build stone. Let's see if it lets us do that. Uh, oh, right over there. Okay. Over here. 
This is the small map. And I'm, I'm used to a map being much larger than this, so that's, maybe that's why I don't have as much wood by this time as I'm as I'm used to. Take you out. All of those, those, that. And those two right there. Let's add an extra portal to this one. There'll be a lot more moving back and forth. Every time they... <clears throat> Every time they come in to do something, it kicks off five seconds off the timer. Here, there's less of them. We're going to come through twice, take the trees down, and then come through two or three more times to get the logs, and they're done. Yeah, one more time. Let's replace the roots. And we'll grab the sand for later, too. Oh, I see. We can't replace the roots because... Well, we can. Tech tree. Okay. What did I do to advance that? That's interesting. Anyway, close. I could do this one, assuming that when they take this out, that thins down. Or, you know, shallows. There we go. All right, so in that case, will they have enough? Yeah, they've got enough time there. All right, so that is all going to be done. Let's craft. Oh, that wasn't much wood. Oh, that's frustrating. Of course, we haven't brought it all in yet, but still, that's not much wood. I was going to put another floor on here. I'm tempted to go ahead and take this level down. That thing is so short. I think I will. Doing that's not so easy, though. Um, that is that level, so if we do this on this level, let's do that. Okay, you go away, remove, and in fact, we'll pop that out until they do that. I'm going to take that floor off up there and make only two levels high because it's just going to take so much wood to accomplish this. That there, as soon as that goes away, pop that in. And that's not what I wanted. Oh well. Alright, with that I can... What's the best way? Just right click on those. Okay, that works. Otherwise, if I told them to take that off first, they'd all go up there, dig out underneath themselves, fall down, scream, uh, lose part of their hearts, and then go up and do it again, and again, and again, and again. <laughs> It'd be a broken record. Alright, pop one of these in here and there. And take these out. And our second floor is already half done. That's the idea. And you just trapped yourself. Uh-huh. All right, take it out. There we go. Yeah, sometimes they're not the sharpest knives in the drawer. So that gave us back a whole bunch of wood, or stone, or wood walls. So let's put another layer in here. Now, we saw the catapult um, monster. Don't have a, a name for him. Do I have a name for him? I might have a name for him. Let's see if we can figure out who that was. That was impressive. Well, that was a lot of monsters. What were you? Attack Mac. Uh, okay, that is in the... Boy, which one is that? Is it the desert one? It's one of the latter maps. Uh, still looking for the, the guy with the catapult on his back. Look kind of like this. Armor Berserker. Hmm, there he is. The giant thrower. Very dangerous. This huge troll. Oh, they've got a cave troll. Throws small zombies directly into your rear and can crash your walls and constructions. <laughs> anyway, we saw that he has a radius of boom, right there. So, if we were to actually take this out and build a nice little landing right in here, then we could, you know, welcome the the, the zombies as they landed and say hi with a with a sword or two. That might be kind of fun. Let's uh, let's think about that. In fact, let's get rid of that layer as a reminder that that's what that's for we have plenty of time to plan for that we want to bet i forget to plan for that but anyway um craft did we get more wood in we got some more wood in let's go to walls 
and let's use the magic 50 over here kaboom 45 well we'll go with that put you back up to the top before i forget and done Let's put another row in here, which is not going to be easy because we're going to need ladders to get them up there. We can pull those other ladders down, though. There we go. Let's get rid of ladder. Just saw that water dissipate. It, uh, it must have rained. All right, do that. Let's put more ladders in. They can go one to either side. So there, that looks about right. Got to get torches in there too, or I'm going to start growing things in here. Still have lots of snails. We can climb up there. We did take these out. Okay, let's take those out as well. Now, lights. How many lights can I put in without disturbing the ladders? A couple. There we go. This ladder needs to go, actually, this needs to go away. Remove wooden hatch. And these ladders all need to be brought back. We do need a lot more wood, though. How are we doing out here? Everybody in? Everybody? No. Oh, he's coming over the top. Ah. So we ran out of portal. And we still have some goods out here. So they're going to want to go back. So let's give them an easy way back to, to be done with it. We'll do that. And yeah, for fun, we'll go and play the zombie. Everything over here is looking good. Except we've got the sheep. Now, any chance we're going to see him this time? Nope. <laughs> Running in there, shields charged. Off they go. Ah, we missed them again. But here comes these. Now ah, let's collect some more. Some more equip. We did get some. Ooh, we got a 17 and a 17. Well, let's equip these really quick. Hello, Maja. Maya? Maya? Maja. Hmm. Anyway, let's get her set up. And do I have? I have. Now, anybody else? Actually, we don't have one of these, though. Need to get her a shield. All right. But who else could use the other skeleton's mace? First club that comes up. Right there, Esther gets it. That's not what I wanted. Right there. Okay. So you guys are set. And you can come back and handle these. Sets up his... His shield there, he's going to get to here. The next one's going to set up his shield. Kind of fun to watch. Quite clever how they designed this. And he goes crashing down and doesn't do any damage. Hmm. Let's give him two portals here in case they time that one out. And let's go say hi. <laughs> I think we're in Lion King when he says that. All right, with that, with all that portal left over, what do you, where do you think you're? You just gotta get that, huh? All right, we'll do this. Attack and attack, and take that tree out again while you're at it. All right, take that tree out too. Plenty of timer. All right, we're good. Can't get through what? Ah, another ladder. Okay. You can go probably right there and do that. And let's put on the second floor. Hello. Oh, you guys really want in, don't you? Yeah, you do. All right, we'll go say hi to you too. And we'll put a second one in. And, hello. So they are running. Actually, they're running through the other portal and going right back out again. Diving into here. Nobody's down to one heart. We're fine there. Okay. You guys can pick up all the zombie brains and... Ooh, mushroom. We'll use that someday. Okay, back to what I was doing. Under attack again? Where is this time? Oh, just those. Okay. Um, where am I? Right there. 
Okay, let's get these in. Now the thought is to have a long room here, but maybe that is not wise. There. Somewhere over here we'll pop another ladder. I just don't know where. I want to see how beds line up and how a kitchen lines up so that we're not uh, making it difficult for later. Anyway, one more torch goes here. And over here somewhere, we're a little dark. See that shadow? That's That tells you that uh, something's going to be growing over there. So, probably... Here-ish? Something like that. Let's pull this ladder out. Move ladder. Torch. I'm thinking right in that spot looks pretty good. Remove the ladder. Right there. Okay, well, we're getting there. What are we going to do with this? I'm not sure. Don't know if bedrooms are in this area or if this is. Hmm. Gonna need several tables for food. Whether that's on this floor or this floor, I don't know. This could be the meeting hall and the kitchen. Kitchen over here and food and something else, which means bedrooms are probably up here, probably two levels of bedrooms. Okay, I can kind of see that. What do we need to be doing otherwise, though? Hello, we're being overgrown over here. All right, take you out. Need to get another light in here. Uh, kind of like right there. Hmm, okay. You're going to go there, replace iron. That's all the replacing that's needed. And Tony wrote in. Tony, have I got the name right? I think it's right. It's not in, my, not in front of me right now. Um, that... There may be a long-term use for this door. At some point later on, it might open up and something may come through it. So we need to think here real soon about going beyond just making this background uh, decoration. That it needs to actually turn back into some kind of a room again. So we're not going to build anything long-term right here until we've thought this one through. But if we do... I'll tell you what, let's do this. Let's just stick a um, build stone there. And... Oh, that's probably good enough for now. I don't think this is something that's going to happen early game. Um, did I click on that? I don't remember doing that. Anyway, but let's go ahead and get the ladder going back down in here again. There we go. No, we got to get rid of that. Not you. Okay, right click. We'll do it that way. Anyways, take this down into here. What have we got going on here? Ah, we got something going on. I can't tell. Okay, as long as it... As I can click and drag, it tells me that there is something there in that same plane. When it stops to do that. Um, like, if I click on this one and then move, it won't do anything here because there's nothing there. Whereas if I click here and move down, it passes this one because it's not on the same plane. So when you're going into the darkness and don't know if you're just going to plummet them into a big void, theoretically, if as long as it keeps clicking, that means that there is something there. But let's get these going. We're just kind of hanging on the ladder here, aren't we, guys? And we're going to find that there are things down here. This is, think of it as like a cocoon that's just waiting to be disturbed. He doesn't like being disturbed. So, there's going to be a consequence when we get down there. We're getting into coal here. Good. Anyway, somehow we're going to line up our, our, our rows again, but I don't know exactly how we're going to pull that off. Let's do this. Let's take you guys out. Let's put a torch in somewhere around here. Oh, I cannot grab that. There we go. Let's take you out. We'll take you while we're at it. Spiders, they do attack you. you got to take them out, but they we, we need the bow and arrow to take him out. Ah, there's a good reason to, hello, get back into working on the bow and arrow. Let's, we're done enough there. We're done enough there. Remove ladder, and I want to put a torch over here, and that'll be done. 
All right, bow and arrow technology. What do we need to do? We did not. What was the last thing that we accomplished? I thought it said iron working. Was there more of a basic iron work? No, we did all that. Anyway, we did. We accomplished something over here. Maybe it was this one. Not sure. We need to get into this one. Forge. We need water. That's where we were. Okay. So I now that we have buckets. Hello. That went little. Oh, something spawned in. That's why. Um, quickly, how fast can we do this and seal that up? And this time we're going to let them just roam around for a while. Boy, there's a lot of them. Now we aren't loose out here, are we? No, we're all at home. Let's get that in there, guys. Come on. Get moving. Get. Uh, you're not going to make it, are you? Get that up there. Put it in. Ah, and use. Timing. <laughs> Otherwise, they would come in. We would have a big fight. They would raid this, steal all kinds of things out of it, and then they would go home. What I'm curious about is if we ignore them for a while. In fact, we can even do something like... Where is that? I want to say that is in, like, this tab? Yeah. Beware sign. So if I were to drop that down there, I could tell our people that they are not allowed to go beyond this. And I could tell them they're not allowed to go past this. So we can work over here now and not worry about anything. I can pop this into here and say take out that bush and that chicken and they would be just fine. Smithing, good. And we do need wood though. We're gonna need a lot of it so we've gotta be collecting every day. You and you. And one should be enough. That's all we're going to do here. Theoretically. We're at 30 minutes there. Okay. Let's go ahead and get that coming as well. There. I'll put two into this one. Alright. Nothing has popped there. It'd be nice to get him. But more nice to get trees. Alright. Let's do... Oh, it is so hard to grab that thing. We're gonna do that, we're gonna do two of them. We're gonna grab that, 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 chicken. I just heard a grunt. I sure thought I did. Guess not. Over here. All right, we should be fine there. Okay, um, iron working. We're still, oh, we're on water. That's what it was. I went for water and that kind of freaked it out. Okay. Under attack over here. Let's get everybody over here and another portal to get it much faster. Am I going to send somebody home? Yeah, I think we're okay. Oh, that was an onslaught, huh? Huh. Those that are badly wounded will just go home and go to bed. But we're fine there. Okay. <laughs> Where was that? That was over here, right? That was over here. Okay. So we're okay. You guys, you guys can get back to hauling things. Anyway, water. I want to finally get to the water. If I were to... And here goes a bunch of them. Now I have a choice of go fishing, but we don't have any fishing rods, or gather water. If I come over here and just scoop and scoop and scoop and scoop and scoop. Actually, if I turn that off, where's our nearest portal? Right over here. Let's gather this water. Okay. Um, okay. Give him a hand, guys. One heart left. I'm going to hang out over here for a while make sure we're okay. And I think we're going to be okay. Yeah. He'll go home and go to bed now. Anyway, over here, water. And now that we have buckets, for as many buckets as we made, they'll do this. So I think we did, I don't know what it was, 9 or 12, whatever it was. It was a multiple of 3. Then they'll haul the water away. Of course, they're a little sloppy with it. Now they got to go swimming. And we'll get a little notice. Dwarf is drowning. Anyway, you guys just have a ball with that. And they'll do it 
really, I guess, until the uh, the water level drops below that square. That's possible. I think I'll, I'll kill the, uh, the command. They're getting a little bit obsessive about that. Now, can we make the forge? Craft. Forge. There we go. Water. Coal. Iron. Stone. And stone. There is a forge. And we'll make two. And we will put it where? Trying to think of what I what I could lose here. I'm going to use every, everything in here. Hopefully I'll remember that it's over here. Um, right there. And food. We haven't dealt with food recently. Let's get this caught up again. Alright, let's make a bunch of those. And we can make up to 60 of these. That'll be plenty. Eggs. Sure, let's make a bunch of those. That'll do us for now. Um... Oh, the, the kitchen. Stone kitchen. Oh. Eh? How can we have stone kitchen stove but not know how to make it? What am I... What am I missing here? That's odd. Okay. And a much better wooden bed. But if I wait just a little bit longer, I'll get the even better one. So I usually skip this stage. Because this requires... What is happening here? This is new to me. You don't... Oh, we've found one. That's what it is. We found one. We have not learned how to make one. Ah, so we have one nice wooden bed. Okay. And we've got quartz and we've got silver. Where did we find... Oh, silver we probably found instead of dug up. Okay. All those mysteries. Let's... Think about putting some food out on the table. What do we have available? We have 30 salads. What if salads are instantaneous? I didn't see somebody making those. So I'll go with that. We'll grab some more apples. And there is no meat. Well, there is eggs. We'll put the put the eggs out. Okay. With that, she's now making more of the uh, steaks. He was injured in that last battle. He's sleeping. And we've got a forge to put out somewhere. Let's go down here. Wow, the spiders are going crazy. <laughs> okay, we need archers, which means we need the forge. And we've got rats. Ah, oh, rats. Okay, let's put these in, and let's go attack the rats. Now, later we'll be able to get, I believe it's pets. And I'm not real sure how that works. It's what I've heard of. It came with the Sisters in Arms DLC, but you'll get to... Uh, have pets, and those pets, like, like a cat or a dog, Linda! will go through and keep the rats at bay. So that will be their role. I would like to take these out, but I really want uh, uh, bow and arrows before we do it. Otherwise, they'll be attacking one over here. This guy will crawl down and just attack from above and go back up. They'll all run away scared, and it's not very effective. Are we in? We're in. Forge. Craft. How do we... Let's, just, let's go to Tech Tree. Where are we at? With the forge, we can make the pickaxe and the iron axe. And that should be enough to satisfy this to get us up into here to start making bows and lots of arrows. And a wooden staff. This is more of the magic. So we have a magic uh, uh, ranged and a, a bow and arrow ranged. And regular or fire arrows. Interesting. And a steel club. I thought there was... A different kind of arrow that wasn't a fire arrow. Maybe it shows up, but it just doesn't act as a uh, uh, as a tech. Okay, um, craft. Let's get into this. So, wood is our is going to be our concentration for a while. So let's go with these guys first. Oh, I only have four iron ore. Darn. Okay. I'm only going to make four of them. So, iron ore. That's where we're going next. And under attack, that is just the mice, right? Yeah. Let's stop concentrating on making nice even rows, and let's just start taking out materials. Let's do that. And that. Then we can replace rear. 
and rear. Okay, you guys will work on that. I'll have to keep up with the torches once in a while to keep things lit up. Put you there. Things flying over here. Okay, so how are we doing on the tech tree? That's... Hmm. What's well, interesting, once you've done one of them, you don't get as much of a bonus, this little bar, next time. This one, we haven't done one yet, so you see the bonus is bigger, the yellow bar, compared to that one. So, we do need to get at least one iron pickaxe in here soon. But this is iron, right? Not going to tell me. That looks like silver. So that's iron there. So we did actually mine out of silver over here somewhere. This guy is the... What? Right there, the larva. Okay. This larva is the embryo of a giant worm sleeping until someone wakes it. Uh, let's go back to that. What is it waiting for us to do? To collect 30 coal, or 10 coal, and to collect 10 iron, and then to get the uh, advanced iron working tech finished. Okay. So, coal and iron. <clears throat> let's take out, let's do this. And let's take out that. Sure, we'll do that. All right, so I see we can get something out of here. Let's put, replace that in the back as well. Replace that one. And we'll hang around long enough to replace this one. So 25 minutes, <clears throat> another 10 minutes or so of this video, and we'll call this one done. 800 points. Wow. And yet... We're not even halfway through level 9, so you can see the levels are getting much more difficult to advance through. Um, found enough iron. Okay. So replace coal. And as soon as you're done with that, we'll replace coal. That should satisfy the coal requirement, or the, uh, well, yeah, the coal. The iron next. Alright, that's there. Alright, so with all that going, and, and you saw that minor plus 1 equip. So, when I say let's go attack them so we can get some experience. As a warrior, we've got that much experience so far on this on this dwarf. As a carpenter, that much. So, we have to give them the title in order for them to start building up experience. She's probably the one that we just saw that plus one hit. So, she's someone that we would want to get the pickaxe on. And she would be heading for the mining jobs while someone else is heading for the carpentry jobs. So, eventually, we're going to have to specialize everybody. There is a logger. So, definitely want to get a good axe. In fact, do we have the axe now? We don't. Why don't? Oh, we do. It's right there. Okay. We only have one so far. Okay. So, logger. Logger. What would be advantageous? A logger would be out hunting. You're now a hunter as well. And what else? Probably a warrior. Okay. So you're our first logger hunter warrior. So as Helene does any of these tasks, she's going to start building up skills in those levels. Now I think that there was a way to undo all of this, but I think it was a spell or so, I mean a potion. Drink that, and this clears. I'm trying to remember. It's been a long time. Um, but we were looking for a shield at one time, too. Let's get, Let's see if we can make two extra shields. We can make four. We get one ahead. Okay. And equip right there. All right. Anybody else? If I just hold it, we'll go through them all real quick, and that never varies. So we're good. Over here, there. One pair of shoes is out there. All right. That's good enough for now. So we need lots of iron to get ahead on that tech tree. Let's... Looks like we need to put a dirt here. Build... Uh, replace iron ore. And I can only do one thing at a time. Okay. Eventually I want to take all these out. I just worry about them falling to their deaths. Now, okay, falling down two squares. Alright, never mind. That's not a problem. Do you? Um, let's start getting some serious supplies into, into here. Silver. Yeah, we'll 
Nah, I think we'll, we'll actually mine this out. Okay. While they're doing all that. Well, actually, before I leave here, though, let's get some light in here. We'll do that. And we'll do that. Alright. Eventually, we're going to get into these larvae. In fact, we're getting real, real close there now. After a while, they will stop running this little um, squirrel cage thing here. And they'll start digging. There you go. If you get close enough, they're going to start trying to dig their way out. In this case, we're going to have two of them running back and forth in here. So, we're, I may as well just hang around here for a moment. Because it's about to get quite... Yeah, I say that and they all leave. Where are you going? Here we go. It's going to get quite crazy here. So, let's... Now, it used to be if you click them early, everybody would stop what they were doing. And they'd have to, the game would have to recalculate everything. And then when they broke through, it wouldn't really work because it wouldn't be a fresh command. So, we'll do it again, and now everybody's going to come and help. But they actually have a pretty vicious bite. These parts are going to go down quite fast. So, we do need to be aware of that. I wish it was easy enough to grab her and pull her out of there. Okay, let's get her out of there. And then go back. Hopefully, she. No, she insists on doing this. Okay, I can't grab her and pull her out and say go to bed easily. I have to click through until I finally find her, and then, then find some way to click go to bed, and, and by the time you figure it all out, they're dead. That's why it's best just to hit the equip finder and put a potion on her and, and get her health back up. It, it isn't that user-friendly to be able to uh, to make those, those quick changes, those, those sudden decisions. All right, let's see if there's anything behind this. Let's replace that one and that one. And we're good there. All right, so this area is good enough for the moment. 21 minutes. Let's go grab some more wood. And roots. Until we finally get to use in those roots, you know, I'm going to be wondering, why does he keep doing that? <laughs> and hopefully the game is going to use them the same way as I remember from long ago, and I'm not just wasting all my time, too. Alright, that clears out this area just fine. 43 left of mana. There's three minutes there, and there's not much to do here. Take that down and back and forth. Yeah, let's do one more just in case. Okay, over here, we still have these guys. This is probably something to deal with next time. I'm guessing chicken. Let's do that. You, you, and you. There. And this was what? Oh, over here. Okay. And then over here. It wouldn't hurt to get into this. Alright, we'll take that out. These guys are going to pop soon, so we'll have to deal with them. Eventually, we're going to have to deal with these guys, but I think they're still going to just come up and circle and then go back down. In fact, we can get them to do that one more time and then go and take them out. Maybe they'll have a bunch of loot in their their uh, their tent there, their headquarters. Don't know if that'll be the case or not, if it's a time thing or if it's an activity thing that determines that. I want that sheep. But we're going to have a lot of this going on. He's a big guy. It's going to take all of us to take him down. Oh, that is over here. There we go. Alright, let's clean this mess up so we don't have to worry about it anymore. I'm ready to send them home if I have to. I'm not seeing any single hearts. There's a one and a half. Yeah. Low health. I don't know where that was. Let's send them home. And let's see it. One of these three. And you, 15% comfort. Interesting. Um, what was that last one? Okay, that's been taken care of. You're picking up the parts. 
in here. Got a spider attack. Okay. And low health again. Someone who was trying to sleep just got nailed, huh? That might be it. And we'll take those spider webs out. Gotta deal with this, though. Really have to deal with this. So how close are we toward toward uh, arrows? Yeah, bow and arrows. We're happy enough over here. Gonna clean up some stuff. Let's give him one more. Okay, that one's done. All right, so bow and arrows. To get there, we just needed the iron. All right, let's see if we can make more axes now. 13, there we go. So we have one. Let's not necessarily do every one. Not all will be out there chopping trees. Okay. Something like that. And let's do this guy. Oh, I have to build it. And it looks like I can do four of them. Yep. Yeah. We'll do that and that should be enough they have to make them first what is that symbol there's more aha the archer's glove the horn spell this will call everybody to that spell so there's a uh, the church bell going off that, that the town's on fire kind of a thing you want everybody to rally at a certain point that one will do it. And we seem to have a collected coal. A spawn point in here for animals. <laughs> I can't seem to get rid of that. Anyway, we're doing that. You guys are not really noticing. Well, maybe you are called over here. Okay, I'll give you... Nope. There. One more just in case. So, what next? I have to wait until these guys are done. And you automatically came over there. Select Dwarf, you are Maya. Ma Maya? I'm going to go with Maya. You let me know if that's if that's wrong. Um, equip Maya with the Forge. Forger? Is it Smith? Carpenter? Might be Smith, as in Blacksmith. We'll go with that. So you're an indoor warrior. We'll, we'll put it that way. And let's make you a carpenter also. A couple of indoor jobs and you can fight. And these then. Well, not these. Yeah, let's go into here. Release. Click away. Craft. There we go. So these then are things that will enhance all of those skills. So a smith's apron with leather and iron can go on to the smith to make the smith's job, uh, make the smith's skill up quicker, let's put it that way. So equip and smith, you now get the apron. goes right there. So now she, her smith's skills will increase at a faster rate. What does it actually say? Increases efficiency of the smithing skill. Okay. So that's the concept there. And so we could micromanage, you know, go through it and, and, and really work the efficiency of everything that way. Um, how are we doing in here? Let's get some more lighting in before I go away from that. Click and hold. And what is the trouble here? I don't know. That's not supposed to be there anyway. No. Okay. So, lighting, and I'm just got a portal to pick this stuff up a little bit quicker, but no. Anyway, I feel like we're winding down here. Can't do anything till these are done. Let's place some more walls, and we'll call this episode finished. 17, we can make 87 more. Let's do that. Oh, that did all of them? Not what I meant to do. Oh well, we have all of them now. Okay. Gotta think about our catapult range over here. Oh, that's something that I missed. I did miss that. 
These need to go away. Remove torch. Yeah, so we'll stick another torch in there. These need to be stone. Or at least four deep of something. It could be four deep of wood. That's possible. Let's leave that and that. Let's think about this. Yeah, let's do that. So this goes away. That goes away. That and that. And that'll be good enough. Once those are done, then I'll put the new stuff in. So that goes away. These stay. These stay. I think that'll work. So stone is going to go here. Eventually. They're just taking their sweet time, aren't they? And you fell on. <laughs> Gotta go to bed. Uh, food. Let's take a look at food while we're waiting. There. There is a rat in the kitchen. Of course. Where else would they be? And. Oh, you know what? I bet you we're not forging because these guys are scaring everybody away. We can't get bow and arrow until we forge. Is that correct? Craft. Uh, there. I don't have a bow that I completely missed, right? No, I don't. Okay. Now we're stuck until we qualify for it, but we've got to use these to qualify for it, and this is scaring them away. But it's best to stand right here and shoot them with a bow and arrow. So this is just not going to be easy. I don't think they can fight on the ladder. And I can't get a ladder up in there, can I? I have just to stand up there. Well, he's afraid to work because of them. Yeah, this is a bad spot. This really is. Low health. Okay, guys. There. Go home. All right. Go home. There you go. All right, well, let's see if we can finish these walls. And... Ah, uh, probably can't get to it, huh? Build stone. That might be the case. Otherwise, we're just, just plain busy. Okay, you did that. Yeah, this is winding down. Let's place a few more of these, and we'll call this one done. I feel like I'm getting tired watching this. <laughs> and something like this. We'll get the stone walls in next time before that next attack hits. Actually, we're going to have to really concentrate on it because I see the timing is getting pretty close. You're going away. Um, yeah, you can be a dirt in the background just to save, save materials. Okay. Now, this is going to be a door. That's going to be a door. In fact, that is right there. Okay. And that is, well, when this builds, this will be right there. So you are actually wood. And then a door will go there. Okay, that's starting to, to make sense again. All right, so what I was thinking about doing here is just doing that. It'll give me a solid wood wall. Same thing here if this ever builds. So, nope, uh, not here. You are stone. Build stone, and then the wood wall goes out here in front. So we're only going to be three stone, but we'll be four walls combined. And here's a trick I don't know if I've shown you. You can take the wood and go over any of these floors and choose what shape you want it to be. So we can do that. When this happens, then we'll get a wall that builds down across there. That's going to be all stone. They just aren't taking them out. Maybe we need to help them out. Not enough resources. Okay. Ladder. And we're out of wood. Okay. So, we're going to call this one done. This has been Noble Rambler, and thanks guys for watching. Bye-bye.